Ready for a fun PSLE 2025 math puzzle? This challenge looks like a little art project. We've got a figure that is made up of three identical equilateral triangles with some parts overlapping. Our job is to find the length of AB. Now, before we dive in, do you remember what an equilateral triangle is? Yes, it's a triangle with three equal sides. Every side is the same. So if we can find the length of one side, we'll know the length of all the other sides, including AB. Now here's where it gets interesting. Since the triangles overlap, there must be something special about them, right? Let's play around and see if we can discover what it is. Here are two identical triangles. Watch the bottom closely as I slide them along. What do you notice? See the extra parts that are sticking out on the left and right? The length of each triangle that doesn't overlap is exactly the same. That's pretty cool, eh? Let's try it again so you can really see it. Now you might be wondering, why is this important? Well, let's zoom into the two triangles on the left. We're given that this length that doesn't overlap on the left triangle is 18 cm. What do you think the length that doesn't overlap on the right is? If you said 18 cm, you're right. Good job for thinking of that. This gives us a big clue. We know the total length over here is 41 cm. Now that we've found this length, we can subtract it from 41 cm to find the remaining length over here. 41 cm minus 18 cm is 23 cm. Nice! Now we're only one step away from finding AB. Since we know that this length is 23 cm and this is 3 cm, we can add them up to find the length of one side of the triangle. This will be the same as finding the length of AB. 23 cm plus 3 cm is 26 cm. AB is 26 cm. Did you enjoy cracking this puzzle with me? Check out the next 2025 PSLE math video. Can you solve that?